And now we've talked about what it can look like, but I want to kind of take a step back and I want to talk about the science behind cognitive dissonance because it is fairly interesting. Now, cognitive dissonance, this is very much more common than you would think. And that's because humans, we're not consistent. And this inconsistency makes us uncomfortable and what humans hate most in this world is feeling uncomfortable. But then even more than that, fixing the discomfort, fixing that mismatch is incredibly rewarding from a neurological point of view. So I want to take a step back and I want to talk about the science behind cognitive dissonance. It all begins in the brain and it begins in the anterior cingulate cortex. It detects a conflict between two differing beliefs or values or behaviors. Then it's our prefrontal cortex that begins to rationalize decisions. This helps us to reduce discomfort often by justifying our behaviors through altering our moral beliefs. And when this conflict is resolved, we trigger our dopamine reward pathway. And this makes everything seem all right in the world again, which ends up making us repeat the cycle. 